everybody this is the planet earth here we're looking for a hurricane dorian update all right um so hurricane dorian right now is about let's go ahead and put it into the base for activity okay hurricane dorian's eye wall is about Eighty-five miles from West Palm Beach. Now it looks like it's stalled. I, I just I can't believe this. Since when does Hurricane Category Five hurricane just stall? I've never seen anything like this, and and honestly, I, I this has to do something with the government, in my opinion. This is not normal. Okay, I'm sorry, but I've never heard of massive hurricanes just stalling before hitting anywhere practically, and it looks like. It is kind of starting to get that northern turn now. Um, okay, let's see. Okay, oh my god, they're getting killed. Those people in the Grand Bahamas are just done, dude. And I saw what happened over here on these islands over here too. Uh, on, on, the, on, the, on the islands there. I saw what happened. It's over, man. I've never seen so much destruction in my life. And it's just stalled. So it's just spewing water and wind. For hours upon hours upon hours. It's been going like this since this morning. It's just been hours of wind and rain. I've never seen anything like this before in history. Hurricane Dorian is the most destructive hurricane towards these islands that I've ever seen. It just doesn't go away. It's The eye wall has been with them for, for hours. From Alexandra. Calm. Shut up. Just ordered a taco salad from Pollo Loco. <sighs> Interesting. Anyways, guys, let's look at this. Oh, um, this is ridiculous, man. What kind of hurricane just stalls it out? Oh, you know what? <laughs> I'm a big category five and four hurricane. Right now, I'm just gonna stall over the Grand Bahamas and completely destroy and obliterate their island. I've never heard of that. I've never heard of a massive hurricane coming all the way over here and then all of a sudden just stall out. It's ridiculous. I've never seen anything like this before, ever. But anyways, guys, about 85 miles from Florida. Um, it's a Category 4 now. And it looks like it's just not really... Oh, look, you can see the eyewall on the regular radar now. There it is. There it is right there. Wow, look at all that wind. And it's just, it's not even moving north. It's not doing, it, it's its its just stalling out, not doing nothing, guys. It's, it's just, it's just there. It's just like, eh, I'm not even moving. So the Grand Bahamas is destroyed at this point. I can only imagine. Hey, hon. Hey, baby, can you hear me? <laughs> what? That is awesome. I'm actually communicating through my Echo. Yes, you are. What do you want? <laughs> this is awesome. I'm over here at Pollo Loco. Just letting you know. Did you get the announcement as well that I, that I was at Pollo Loco? Yes. Alright, awesome. Okay, so I'll let you know. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. Okay, I just want to let you know that I actually communicated through my Echo. Okay, so this is the craziest thing that I've ever seen in my life. Ever. So what do you guys think about this? Like, what do you guys think about this? I, I just have no explanation to the amount of carnage right now that's happened on the Great Bahama Island. Just, It's just stalled. It's been hours of destruction. It's not doing anything. It's not going anywhere. It's just stalled. And it's not even moving north. It's just stalled. Like, I've never seen anything like this before. It's actually burning itself out by just stalling. I've never seen anything like this. If anybody has ever seen anything like this, please tell them. Other than Harvey. Other than Harvey. I know what happened with Harvey. But this is a Category 5 hurricane. Now it's a Category 4 hurricane. And just imagine right now on the Grand Bahama Island right now. The continuous amount of wind for hours and hours. It's not stopping. It's been like this since last night. 
And just imagine the damage that island is, is it's pretty much obliterated, it's done. They're gonna they're gonna need a few billion dollars to get back up on their feet. I really hope people will donate millions of dollars to these people because after this hurricane is done, the Bahama is never gonna be the same again and I've been there, so it's sad to see. It's all done. Uh, someone's gonna probably make a, a video of before and after because this is uh, uh, like a tornado just consistently hitting uh, the Great the Grand Bahama. So imagine. But anyways, guys, this has been the six p.m. Central, uh, seven p.m. Eastern uh, update time. Category four. It's not moving. It's it is creating some uh, squall action in Miami and uh, North uh, Southern Florida, but nothing major yet. Maybe a little bit of wind with the with those storms, but nothing major yet. And this this hurricane, I've never seen anything like this before. A massive hurricane just stalling. Most hurricanes just continue to move like normal. But no, we can't have normality, can we? And it, it's like purposely destroying this island. How does a hurricane this big just get stuck like this on an island? Like it just continues. Look at it. It's purposely destroying the island because now the eye wall is over the ocean. And it's just now getting the 140 mile an hour wind gusts, plus gusts like 170, 180, continuously on the Grand Bahama Island. I just imagine the destruction. And even buildings are getting worn out from those high winds by now, and all the flooding, you know, the flooding's got to be at least a, a floor high, if not maybe two floors, because it's pushing all the ocean water onto the island. So just, I, I just, I can't imagine. Thank you guys for watching.